All right. So let's just settle into a nice, comfortable, seated posture. Have both feet flat on the floor if you're not sitting in a cross-legged position already. If you are in a cross-legged position, you can put a couple of cushions under your knee, um, raise your sits bones up to, to change the angle of your pelvic area, your sacrum. Shoulders are aligned with the hips. You can have your hands just resting comfortably in your lap. And just imagine you're lengthening your spine. You know, rather than this idea of sitting up straight, think about length, lengthening your spine. So, you know, we do have these natural curves in our spine. And then imagine your ears aligning with your shoulders. Take a nice deep breath. Bring your attention to the crown of the head. Relax the scalp. Allow some softening into your face, your jaw, temples, ears. And back of the head and the neck and allow your shoulders and shoulder blades just to drop down and relax your throat, chest, belly, your limbs and just notice the breath sensations as you inhale and exhale. Be aware of any sound in your environment so just allow all of those sounds to be there, trying not to run off and investigate with the mind. And if you if you have quite a loud sound, sort of outside, or even not a loud sound, you can just allow for a moment, just allow your mind to, you know, go out, have a look in your mind's eye, and then bring your mind back to the same place your body is. And then bring to mind all our people, all our people, our friends, the ones we don't like or don't trust, and our strangers. And then remembering they're all equal. They all um, want to be happy. They don't want to suffer. And they all have this extraordinary capacity for this Buddha mind. And you also, uh, relationships can be interchangeable, keeping that in mind. And then I think we'll do this meditation this evening for all these people of our life and by extension all sentient beings so we think there is no negativity that can't be purified and this purification process is basically a psychological one we create negativity with our minds so equally we can change it by creating positivity instead and we start with this power of regret so sincerely regret from the depths of your heart anything you have done to harm any living being on this day, in this life, and in all of our past lives. And think of any specific actions of both your body and your speech, and then in general regret all. And the reason to regret is based on this logic of karma. And we experience everything due to our past karma, our past actions, and having harmed others, we ourselves will necessarily experience suffering in the future and we cannot bear the thought of any future suffering that we will experience. And we know from our present suffering we don't want any more, so logically it makes sense to remove the karmic seeds before they ripen as future suffering for us. So think like this, I regret from the depths of my heart 
having harmed others with my body and my speech, having broken my vows because I do not want the future suffering, I am sick of suffering, and also regret any anger, attachment and the rest that are the cause of why we harm others, and then think again, I'm sick of the suffering, and then think, well, okay, so what can I do about it? Whom can I turn to? So now we come to this power of reliance. So we rely upon, we turn to the Buddha, who we see as a doctor, who has the methods that we can use to purify. And we're not relying on or needing Buddha to forgive us. We're purifying ourselves by relying upon his medicine, his methods. So imagine Vajrasattva above the crown of your head, facing the same way as you. You can also imagine that this is actually the mind of your teacher manifesting in this form for your benefit. It, it sort of just makes it a little bit more personal than this, this image, this Vajrasattva image. And you can also imagine that the Vajrasattva is made of this beautiful, radiant, blissful white light. And he's sitting, sitting cross-legged on a white lotus and a moon cushion. And he has a beautiful radiant face and his eyes are long and peaceful and full of love and compassion for you and all those people of your life. He has a sweet red mouth. His hair is black and held up in a top knot. His arms are crossed at his heart, the left underneath the right. The left is holding a bell representing wisdom and the right is holding a vajra, which represents the indestructibility of compassion. And their being crossed represents the union of these two. And this symbolizes enlightenment itself, the development of infinite wisdom and infinite compassion. To the Buddha, the Dhamma, and the Sangha, I go for refuge until I'm enlightened. By this practice of meditating on Guru Vajrasattva, may I reach Buddhahood, so as to benefit all sentient beings. Now, under this section of reliance is a little bit about compassion. So in order to develop compassion, we need to also rely on other beings. So the beings we have harmed and those who have harmed us, by developing a wish for them to be free from suffering. So think particularly of someone you've harmed recently and in the past and then in general all beings we have ever harmed since beginningless time. And then remember those who have harmed you and have compassion for them because the harm they've caused you is going to result as suffering for them sometime in the future. So make a strong aspiration to do this practice for the sake of all these beings and think I must purify for their sake. And then we come to this power of remedy. So this is the medicine doing the practice of purification, and we start with the body. And imagine Vajrasattva very compassionately sending powerful white nectar, like coming out of a hose, quite forcefully from his heart, and it arcs around and enters your crown and pours into your entire body, and it fills you completely. And just imagine it keeps pouring into you until it forces out of all of your lower orifices all the harm you've ever done to any living being with your body in the form of inky liquid and this pours out of you and disappears into space, not one atom left as we recite the mantra. Om Bajrasafa Samaya Manupalaya Bajrasafa Dina Patita Jida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anorakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyatsa Sawa Kama Sata Me Sitam Shriyam Guru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutsa Vajra Bawa Mahasamaya Sata A Hum Pe Om Bajrasafa Samaya Manupalaya Bajrasafa Dina Patita Jida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yatsa sawa kama sita me, sitam shriyam guru hum ha ho bago an sawa tata gata vajra mame mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. Am bajra sapa samaya manupalaya bajra sapa dina patita jida me boa, sito kaya me boa, sipo kaya me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yatsa sawa kama sita me, sitam shriyam guru hum ha ha ho bago an. Sawa tata gata vajra mami mutta vajra bawa maha samaya sata a 
Pompe, and Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Jira Meboa Sitokai Meboa Sipokai Meboa Anorecta Meboa Sava Sidi Mimpiata Sava Kama Sita Me Sitam Shri Amkur Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sava Tata Gata Vajramami Mutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Pompe and Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Jira me boa, sitokai me boa, sipokai me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, sitam shriam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajrama me mutta vajrabawa maha samaya satra a humpe, and vajrasapha samaya manupalaya vajrasapha dina patita, jira me boa, sitokai me boa, sipokai me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Am Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Trita Me Boa Sitokai Me Boa Sipokai Me Boa Anorecta Me Boa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum so be delighted that all the harm you've any you've ever done to any sentient being with your body is now completely purified and think that there's no way you could do anything but benefit others now with your body. And next is this purification of our speech and Vajrasattva very happily sends powerful nectar from his heart chakra and it arcs around and quite forcefully enters your crown and fills your entire body except this time it forces up to the top of your body all the negativity of your speech, and this overflows and disappears into space, not one atom left. So just imagine that all the gossip and the harsh speech and the useless speech and lying and talking about people behind their backs and getting other people to sort of agree with you, all of this is purified by this powerful nectar filling you as we recite the mantra. Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Jira Me Boa Sitokaya Me Boa Sipokaya Me Boa Anorecta Me Boa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yatta Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Jira me boa, sitokai me boa, sipokai me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, sitam shriam kuru hum ha ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajrama me mutta vajrabawa maha samaya sata a hum pe, and vajrasapha samaya manupalaya vajrasapha dina patita, Jira me boa, sitokai me boa, sipokai me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, sitam shriam kuru hum ha ha ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajrama me mutta vajrabawa maha samaya sata a hum pe, and vajrasapha samaya manupalaya vajrasapha dina patita, Jira me boa, sitokai me boa, sipokai me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, sitam shriam kuru hum ha ha ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajrama me mutta vajrabawa maha samaya sata a hum pe, and vajrasapha samaya manupalaya vajrasapha dina patita, Jira me boa, sitokai me boa, sipokai me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Am Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Jira Me Boa Sitokai Me Boa Sipokai Me Boa Anorecta Me Boa Sawa Sidi Me Pi Yata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe and Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Jira Me Boa Sitokai Me Boa Sipokai Me Boa Anorecta Me Boa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satva A Hum 
So again, feel so happy that your speech is now completely purified. And imagine it's not possible to do anything but benefit others with your speech. This includes yourself. And next is this purification of our mind. And Vajrasattva now very compassionately sends powerful beams of light from his heart chakra in this arcs around and enters your crown and fills your entire being. So you imagine you walk into a room, um, you flick on the switch, the room's dark, and that light that comes instantly dispels all of the darkness in the room. So it's the same here. The moment the light from Vajrasattva's heart hits your heart chakra, all the darkness of the negativity of your mind, all your attachment, neediness, bitterness, grudges, anger, depression, anxiety, insecurities, all of this instantly dispelled, not one atom left as we recite the mantra again. Om Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Drido Meboa Sutrukaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawasidi Mimpi Yatta Sawa Kama Sita May Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Am Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Jira me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, sitam shriam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajra mami mutta vajra bawa maha samaya sata a hum pe, am bhajra sapha samaya manupalaya bhajra sapha dina patita, Jida me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Am Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Jida Me Boa Sitokaya Me Boa Sipokaya Me Boa Anorecta Me Boa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Jida Me Boa Sitokaya Me Boa Sipokaya Me Boa Anorecta Me Boa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Jida me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajra mami mutta vajra bawa maha samaya sata a hum pe, am vajrasapha samaya manupalaya vajrasapha dina patita, Jida me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hum Pe So again, be delighted that all your delusions, which are the source of all of our suffering and the cause of why we harm others with our body and our speech, are completely purified and think that there's no space in your heart now for anything other than love and kindness and forgiveness and wisdom and bliss and compassion. And next is this purification of even the imprints of negativity of our body, speech, and mind. And so this time imagine that Vajrasattva sends light and nectar. It fills you completely and eradicates even the subtlest imprints of negative energy from your consciousness. Om Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Jida Me Boa Sitokaya Me Boa Sipokaya Me Boa Anorecta Me Boa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Am Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Jida Me Boa Sitokaya Me Boa Sipokaya Me Boa Anorecta me boa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, 
Sitam Shiyam Kuru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagavan Sawatata Gata Vajramami Mutsa Vajrabhava Mahasamaya Sata Ahum Pe Ambhajra Safa Samaya Manupalaya Bhajra Safa Dina Patita Jida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawasidi Mimpiyatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shiyam Kuru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagavan Sawatata Gata Vajramami Mutsa Vajrabhava Mahasamaya Sata Ahum Pe Am Vajra Safa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Safa Dina Patita Jida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawasidi Mimpiyatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagavan Excuse me Sawatata Gata Vajramami Mutsa Vajrabhava Mahasamaya Sata Ahum Pe Am Vajra Safa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Safa Dina Patita Drita me boa, sito kaya me boa, sipo kaya me boa. Ano rakta me boa, sabo sidi min piyata sawa kama sita me. Sita am shriyam gar... Excuse me. Om ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me muta vajrabawa maha samaya saka a hum pe. Ambadra safa samaya manupalaya vajra safa dina patita. Trita me boa, sito kaya me boa, sipo kaya me boa. Ano rakta me boa, sawa sidi min piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me muta vajrabawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. Am vajra safa samaya manupalaya vajra safa dina patita. Trita me boa, sito kaya me boa, sipo kaya me boa. Ano rakta me boa, sawa sidi min piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shiyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama mi muta vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum te. So now feel completely purified and there's not one atom of negativity left in your mind stream. Even the subtlest obscuration to your enlightenment have been removed. And now we come to the power of resolve, and this is the fourth and final step in the purification process. And it's a really crucial one. This is this determination to refrain from harming with our body and our speech and our mind. And without this, we're just going to keep doing the same old thing over and over again. And this determination, this aspiration to not harm becomes like a beacon that guides our body and our speech and our mind in new directions. So we just develop this wish in our heart to refrain from harming. And then <clears throat> rejoice in your efforts coming along. We've got several people here in different time zones. So for Shrey, it's the beginning of the day. For Gabe, it's the middle of the day. And for some of you East Coast people, it's way past bedtime. So thank you for coming, all of you. And just rejoice in your own and other people's efforts in coming along. And then think of something you'd might, you might like to work on between now and tomorrow. Keep it simple. Keep your timeline simple. Don't overthink it. Just, just make it easy. So it's just a slow kind of process of relearning, rewiring the mind, retraining the neurological pathways to sort of move, flow differently. So imagine Vajrasattva is delighted with us and wants to merge with your mind and melts into white light and absorbs into you through your crown and think, my teacher's body, speech, and mind, Vajrasapha's body, speech, and mind, and my own body, speech, and mind are the same. And next, Rinpoche recommends to meditate on emptiness. So he would say, in emptiness, there is no I, the creative negative karma, there is no action of creating negative karma, and there is no negative karma created. So whatever level your mind understands emptiness, just place it there for a moment, even if it's just the word. And we can look at, think about all phenomena as being empty. They do not exist from their own side. You can also think that the way things appear to me may not necessarily be the way they actually exist. 
So let's just dedicate all the merit, all the positive energy you've created doing this practice to all living beings and think, may all the virtuous karma I've created from doing this practice ripen as my enlightenment for the sake of sentient beings as quickly as possible. So let's just do our, our few verses. <clears throat> Amused with every object of existence, a mind of passion, loving emptiness, transcending worldly passion and the like, with great enjoyment for the threefold world, with fair complexion, white like pristine clouds, with radiance like beams from autumn moons, with luster rivaling the morning suns, with nails emitting light of crimson red, whose handsome crown has sterling sapphires, whose hair has tips of sapphire deep blue, with glory from the light of his great jewel adorned with emanations of the Buddhas. And let's just have a strong wish for His Holiness the Dalai Lama to live long for the swift return of Lama Zopa Rinpoche's unmistaken reincarnation, which is why we do those little verses. And then for all of your own personal teachers to live long. And does anyone have a request for tomorrow morning? <clears throat> 